latest biblical blockbuster from Mark Burnett, Roma Downey, Son of God, retells the story of Jesus, and it is hitting theaters, a time when Hollywood is hot for religious stories. Our David Wright took us behind the scenes. Tell us, are you the Son of God? I am. It's not a remake, but a resurrection. His name is Jesus. A biblical blockbuster like we haven't seen in years. And Jesus hasn't been on the big screen for 10 years. The Son of God in theaters at the end of this month is the first of several big Bible movies in the works. It seems that Hollywood has rediscovered religion. Why is that? Oh, I'm sure the Bible series. The Bible miniseries had blockbuster ratings last year on the History Channel. What was it that led you to believe that, that there needed to be a new version? It really is a calling. Here's a movie um, that speaks to the people that attend church, but also, I think, a movie that is there for the people who don't go to church. It is a love story at its essence. Mark Burnett co-produced the miniseries and the movie, along with his wife, actress Roma Downey. Downey, best known as the star of Touched by an Angel, plays the Virgin Mary in Son of God. My son. It was profoundly moving to step into the role because we know Mary was the mother of the Son of God, but she was also the mother of a son. Mark Burnett, of course, is best known for his hugely successful reality shows. This thing that couldn't be further from reality TV. Is this redemption for you? Without those other shows, we probably wouldn't have got listened to. The Bible series wouldn't have gotten on American TV. The couple has been spreading the word in places movies normally don't market. In Houston this weekend with Pastor Joel Osteen. Several pastors announced they were taking over every screen in a megaplex. And, and uh, that's happening in Miami. That's happening in Oklahoma City. That's happening Charlotte. in Charlotte, North Carolina, Carolina, New York City. God is moving. Things are happening that we never imagined. For Good Morning America, David Wright, ABC News, Los Angeles.